Let's pretend that this jar is us before we have heard and accepted Jesus as our Savior. And as you can see, it's full of sin and it starts to show on the outside. For example, we show jealousy and we become boastful. We lie to people, we become envious and we judge others. We show bad language and we show favoritism. But when we hear the word of God and we accept Jesus as our savior and we choose to follow him, he removes all of our sin. And he makes us righteous. We also know from the book of James that God plants his word in our hearts. He is generous to give us his wisdom. And he gives us his Holy Spirit. But hold on a second. There's still one problem. Our inside doesn't show on the outside. Is this right? Is this how God wants us to live our lives? Do our actions show that we love God and it shows how great he is? No, of course not. This is why God inspired James to write this letter to the believers. He wants our lives to show that we love him and he wants us to help others love him too. He wants us to choose his ways and not the world's. Perfect. Now our inside shows on the outside. We pray in faith. We take joy in tough times. We show God that we are his friend. We live honorable lives that are pleasing to God. We control what comes out of our mouths. And we patiently wait for God because we trust in him and know that he is in control of everything.